That's right, Aaron. By now, everybody in Flint knows where to go to get bottled water. It's become kind of a daily routine for them, and unfortunately, a reality that's not going away anytime soon, especially with new concerns that come up every day. The feds rejected Governor Snyder's latest request asking to expand the Women, Infants and Children Nutritional Program to Flint children from 5 to 10 years of age. WIC currently provides federal funding for food, health care and nutrition education for low-income pregnant women and infants and kids up to 5 years old. The USDA says any changes to WIC eligibility would require congressional action, but Snyder says the ongoing water crisis in Flint warrants an exception. He responded today saying in part it's essential for all all levels of government to work together to help Flint recover from this crisis. And while I understand WIC funding does not normally cover children over the age of five, the improved health and developmental growth that will come from better nutrition for these kids necessitates a waiver of this rule. Flint switched two years ago to the Flint River from Detroit's water system to save money. The improperly treated water caused lead to be leached from pipes. We'll back out here live. Uh, there are a number of ways you can help the residents of Flint. We'll put all of that information on our website, WXYZ.com. We're live in Flint, Jane Park, 7 Action News.